Please pause for a moment of silence. Please stand for the pledges. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Now for the Texas Pledge. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to thee, Texas, one state, under God, one and indivisible. Good morning, Eagles. I'm Ison, and today is Friday, January 7th. I'm Jasmine Lewis, and on today's show, we have information on track and the All-American Bowl. This and more up next on Eagle TV. The girls track captain stopped by the studio to talk to Jackson about their upcoming season. Yo, what's up, Eagles? It's your boy, Smoothie J, back with another Sports Action with Jackson. I hope you all had a happy new year, and... Well, I'm here with our Lady Eagles track captains. So, if you guys want to introduce yourself. T. Landry. Day. And what events are you guys running this year? The one, the two, the four, the relays, and long jump. I'm running the two, four, and then high jump. 100, 200, 400, the relays, and long jump as well. So, if anybody's thinking about maybe joining the track team, how could they go about doing that? Um, we have tryouts Saturday. Contact Swear Engine or Gretzinger for more information. And how do you think we're going to do this year? I think we're going to do good considering we went to regionals last year. So with our team now, I think we're going to go to state. Periodism. What of the day is periodism? Go Eagles! <laughs> Eden Theater will be presenting the musical James and the Giant Peach Thursday, January 20th through Sunday, January 23rd. This Saturday, January 8th, stop by the Chipotle on Heritage Trace Parkway from 5 to 9 p.m. and to support your junior class. You can order online with the code or take a picture of the flyer on the hallway's TVs to show them in the store. Please watch this video that Fort Worth SROs produced that using social media to make threats against schools. Threats to a school are illegal. This can cause schools to go on lockdown while students and staff shelter in place. When 911 is called, an officer is immediately dispatched. Violence is a serious issue that affects our schools. The Fort Worth Police Department investigates all threats to our campuses to enhance the safety and security of all of our students and staff. All threats are taken seriously and urgently, even if the threat is intended as a joke. A person commits a school threat when they threaten any action involving violence to any person or property with the intent to place anyone in fear of imminent bodily injury. A person also commits a school threat if with intention to cause alarm, injury, or damage to school property, threatens or exhibits a firearm. Our officers investigate all school threats thoroughly. You can be arrested. Threats against the schools will be prosecuted. It's not a joke, it's not a prank, it's a crime. Think before you post. Together we can all work to end school violence. Stay safe. Eagles, turn on NBC this Saturday at noon to watch Eaton's very ho own Hunter Herb play in the All-American Bowl in San Antonio. Hunter will become the first Northwest ISD player to compete in the All-American Bowl. Hunter is one of the top ranked football prospects in the nation, earning an invite to the game. That's all we have for you today, Eagles. I'm Jasmine Lewis. And I'm Ison, and we'll see you on the next one.